<laughs> what's up, what's up? My name's Jamal Jackson, filmmaker from New York originally, but I grew up in Montreal. I'm a photographer, I'm a filmmaker, I produce artists as far as music, I rap myself, and I'm running a label at this moment, Woke Records. So there's one thing that people don't know about me, or at least it's a rare known fact, is the fact that I actually fell in love with filmmaking on uh, the set of Are You Afraid of the Dark when I was a kid. So I was a childhood actor, and uh, just seeing the whole machine, how everything works, the cameraman and all that, I fell in love with that position. I did not want to be an actor at all. I really told myself that I wanted to be a cameraman at some point, so that's it. Denzel Washington for his depth and uh, the amount of work he puts towards, uh, you know, towards his his his, uh, his characters, basically. So yeah, Denzel Washington all day. American Gangster is one. The second would be in uh, Pride and Glory, and the third one is Mo Better Blues, uh, and all of them because of the way he portrayed the characters. Yeah, amazing. Akira Kurosawa. Um, he's the precursor to anything that's Star Wars related. Most of the aesthetics when it comes to like Japanese filmmaking, when it comes to like samurai movies, he's the one, you know. And as just as far as like the director and how he gets his actors to really come through with the with the scene, it's, it's something you rarely see in the universe. You know? Music a lot, and just my fellow acting friends. That's how I get my inspiration. Repeat, repeat, repeat. That's how you overcome struggle. To travel the world while actually just filming a project, to shoot in like many, many countries, that'd be nice. What's next? Well, I shoot a lot of music videos, so uh, you know, be on the lookout for the name Jamal Jackson. So as far as this project, what I really like on set is the fact that it's very lighthearted, that we, uh, you know, we're all passionate individuals and we really, really care about the outcome, but just that vibe in general is just so laid back. It's, it's, it's so different than a lot of sets, so I really appreciate it.